Away from that, many people, including health officials, have praised a 33-year-old woman uh, who is a midwife for her selfless commitment to saving lives of pregnant women and their babies in hard-to-reach communities in the Ashanti region. Without access to an ambulance, Delali Gavo of the local Motokrodua chips compound has improvised the use of wooden doors to transport expectant mothers to health facilities for delivery. Ohiming Teria of our health desk travelled to meet Delali Gavo. Here's his report. <laughs> Motokrodia is a small farming community in the Sache East District of Ashanti region. It is one of the hard to reach areas in the district with thousands of harmless scattered in the thickets of a forest. Many of the settler farmers are plagued with many waterborne related diseases and other health conditions. Justice Ofori Amwa is the district director of health. When you get to Motokrodia, it's a forest, and therefore you have a lot of these community members who live in the forest, in the harmless. So you get to uh, community A, you have to, you get about two or three people, you move to the nest. So getting them is not so simple. Many residents living below poverty levels cannot afford health care services and prefer home remedies. Pregnant women often suffer near-death complications as they fail to attend antenatal clinics. Some are delivered on their farms and others are transported to the Motocrodia Chips compound for attention by the only midwife here, the Lali Gavo and her team. Some of the cases we always attend to uh, snake bites, scorpion sting, malaria, diarrhea. We have uh, committees such as Titicasu, New Apasu, and Piedra, uh, Adukrum, that they are saying. And the distance is far from where they are to the facility. So we do home visiting, get to the community, we attend to some of them. The serious one, we bring them to the facility to attend to them. Lacking access to more travel roads, ambulance or other means of transportation for critical referral cases, Ms. Gavo has improvised and resorted to the use of wooden doors to transport her clients. Two wooden slabs are joined with nails at the two ends of the door to support head pass. Patients lie in a supine position on the door and are carried on the head with the help of three men. This ingenuity has helped save many expectant mothers and their unborn babies. This woman was so weak and was lying there. She mentioned some complaints to me that she's feeling lower abdominal pain and dizziness. That's why she's not able to walk. After the assessment, I realized that she's having a BP, a high BP. Then when I listened to the fetal heart rate, it was very low. And I realized that whatever that the fetal was lying in was very green. So it gave me a signal that we can easily lose this uh, baby. Twenty-year-old Zelia Yaya is among expectant mothers saved by this improvised wooden door ambulance. She had declined seeing an untrained traditional birth attendant in a nearby hamlet until the lali arrived. Thanks to the ingenuity of Delali, she safely delivered a bouncing baby girl. I'm the Delali. I'm the Apaso. I want to take a look at the baby. This is the Anapa. I'm a worker. I'm the. So my mother buy no such as a cup of tea. We buy a jar of coffee. So my mother buy. I'm the one who buys. 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 I'm a friend of mine, cause I'm not buying, but now I can't pay my rent. I know he's a new employee, he's a new employee of three. No more pedal, no more money, no more swam. 
So I'm also a mere good cook, be as a normal brown or mass, you know, my home, Madame Della, Edda Fuku, Tudo, Anna Miami, Papa, Anna Kenneth, Anna Sakola, or one of us who are me called Clinic Moor. As a norm, the Lali has been visiting Zelia and her baby for counseling and postnatal health. For Zelia, the wooden doll has become part of her life saving story. She gazes at it almost every day, reminiscing. Such a East District Health Director, Justice Ofori Amwa, and his team who visited the area want the wooden ambulance preserved seeing the door and what a door is made of and what it's meant for and eventually it has been used as something improvising to to save a life of a woman who was in labor and saving the unborn fetus I see this door to be symbolic and be used as a tourist site and attraction. This is not the only good act of Delali. She single-handedly led the production of hospital beds to complement the ones provided by the district assembly and also mobilized the community to fund the purchase of solar panels for the facility. She has since become the toast of many, especially among her peers. The Lali was voted the best midwife for such a East District in 2019 and was recently selected by the Ghana Registered Nurses and Midwives to compete for best nurse at the regional level. Mrs. Juliana Edumensa is the district's right. public health nurse. We know Della to be a person who is very hardworking, so we were not surprised of her initiative as well. She has made the district proud, and we, the district, we acknowledge that. We did that when we made her the best nurse that was in 2019. So we are also proud of her, for her raising the bar. The situation at Motokrovia is a reflection of the challenges faced by health workers in the Seche East District in their quest to bring health care to the people. The district's health director has acknowledged the support of the Seche East District Assembly. Justice Ophoria Moa, however, wants public support. 